what's up you guys welcome back into my channel so today i'm actually standing in the pantry because i went ahead and grabbed some school snacks for the kids they start back this week that you guys are actually seeing this video um so i would be doing a meal planning video but i wanted to get up kind of the school snacks um and then kind of a trying to reorganize a little bit in here um so i'm going to show you guys the school snacks that i got the organization things that i bought off amazon so we are doing good on getting back on track back on a schedule but it is the summer flu let me know down in the comments if you feel like this summer went by like so fast i don't know i just feel like i blinked and the summer was over that's how i feel and so this is what i am working with i used to have like the really big white bins from target in here and i used to just toss everything in there just because it was easy for them but now they like a lot of like granola bars and stuff like that if you guys are new like i don't mind what they eat for um their lunches because i know for dinner time they're getting a really good healthy dinner um they eat their fruit after they get home from school and then if i do pancakes and um french toast and that type of stuff breakfast burritos and put it in the freezer i know i'm actually making it so i don't really mind what they eat for lunch um so i just feel like this isn't working um so this actually shouldn't be here but the granola bars just it's not it's not working so these are the items that i bought i just stuck them up here um so i bought this container right here and i figure it'd be really good to organize granola bars because i can just stand them up or like small pack stuff and then seeing how this is like real small it's not going to take up too much room i didn't want to leave the upper part of the shelf just as wasted space so i ordered this wire basket um and that can just like go on a shelf like so um so that it could take up the upper end of the shelf so i'm still able to go ahead and utilize that i'm thinking about doing like um checks mix and just the other stuff that i buy up there on top so it's easy for them to grab and go um, i used to have a whole bunch of these over at the california house and i used them at the bottom to go ahead and put their lunch boxes in and then um, i just stuck everything in here when we came back from target so we got some skinny popcorn packs um, at the beginning of the year i just like to make life super easy and i will buy these pre-packaged things um and then throughout the year i will go ahead and just buy the big skinny popcorn pack and pre-package them myself but at the beginning of the year it's so just trying to get on routine and just all that stuff that this just makes life easy at the beginning so we got some skinny popcorn they love these pretzel crisps um you can actually get a big bag of these over at costco that's usually where i do buy them but once again just trying to make life easy just right now at the beginning so we got those individual packs the kids love doritos and so um, we couldn't find just the bag of just individual bag of doritos so we just ended up grabbing this and i'll separate it myself we got this like little mini pack of cookies oreos nutter butter bites and then chips ahoy just to try and give them a little bit of a sweet during their day to give them their little energy we got a pack of these uh, peanut butter sandwich uh, cracker sandwiches and they really like these and I love the peanut butter. You can make these yourself too. I do do those um, every once in a while but I like to buy these. They're not that expensive for these packs as well so I like to grab those. I don't buy these often um, but Nevea was asking for them so i said yes to those these were three for six dollars these are actually some of nevea's favorite favorite uh, granola bars and these are actually hard to find but target actually had them so i got three boxes of those i also got the ritz crackers with cheese so we have peanut butter and cheese for them to like pick one whatever they want 
and then what I'll do is I'll put in their lunch boxes a uh, Ziploc baggie so whatever they don't finish that they open they can just put down put in a Ziploc baggie when they get back to their backpack or whatnot and they can keep it for the next day or for after school or anything like that. D loves a trail mix so I got this really big bag of classic trail mix for him. I needed some more chicken broth and beef broth just to have on like a standby here. I like to have them for like soups and just stuff like that. So I needed to grab more of that. These in Nature Valley, um, the peanut butter ones are Dee's favorite. He's obsessed with these. So I got a really big box um, over at Target of these for him. I got some more beef consomme because I needed another one for when I do beef stroganoff. We needed some more caramel syrup because that's a necessity. Nevaeh has been wanting these Cheez-Its, that extra toasty one, for so long. And I'm not into the extra toasty, so I kept talking her out of it just for, like, the classic uh, Cheez-Its. But I finally told her, go ahead and grab it, and we can do, like, small little baggies for you for your lunch. So I had her get that. And then the rest of the stuff are just notebooks for them and folders and then just all these folders for them. So instead of doing binders this year, they want to just do like a folder for each of their subject. They feel like that might be an easier way um, to go ahead and just organize their stuff and I tell them whatever you guys want, however you guys feel is going to be easiest to organize for you then that's fine. So I did go ahead and get the folders that have the prongs inside just in case the teachers give them something that would go into their binder. Um, they can still have it right in there. So we will see. And then how we did it was the color folder will coincide with the color of the paper um, binder or the paper notebook. There you go. So that they can just keep it together and pull out the same colors at the same time. Um, so that's the game plan. That's how they want to organize it this year. And I said, that's fine. So what I'm going to do is bring out the organizer out to the kitchen area and then bring out all their granola bars and all that, and then get that organized, come back in here and get stuff switched around and see how the flow will be easier in here for back to school.
Okay, you guys, so they're able just to go ahead and walk up and grab whatever they want and toss it in along with the sandwich. Um, of course, they're not able to get like one, 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 no. So it's either going to be like one bag of popcorn, which this is healthy popcorn. These are good pretzels. So they either grab one or the other and then either one bag of um, cookies or a thing of fruit snacks. Then they can grab a granola bar along with their sandwich and then they get their fruit when they get home their yogurt when they get home and then obviously a really good dinner so this they know is strictly for school they can't come and just grab this whenever they want um and seeing how they're already getting like a granola bar and all this stuff during um school time then i don't want them to come and grab it when they're home from school so this is the basket where we have extra chips and just like extra dry fruit extra crackers um things that have been sitting here a while i'll go ahead and just um kind of pin to the front so it's kind of like hey you need to eat this before it goes bad we have all the nuts and everything up here that they can snack on um so this is kind of like the other stuff and not for school time type of situation um that they can just pull out grab some fruit grab some crackers grab a couple chips like i don't mind um and go from there so at least i feel good and this is all taken care of once one of these rows kind of clears then i'll open up the chips and put the like individual bags of chips i'll make my own here and then um that will go ahead and just kind of keep things new and keep things different um and then the trail mix i'll do the same thing so i'll just try and buy different things and rotate it so that they don't get tired of it um so that's kind of the game plan but i'm really really happy about how that is turning out um we will see how it goes for this school year um i did buy some of these inv individual packs when we were traveling of cereal so we still have a couple left so i just left them here so that if they were running late they can just grab a bag of cereal and eat it on the way to school um but yeah and then we just have like backups and stuff like that over there and these are all the canned goods and all that this is all baking and then we go into like the pastas and the beans and cereals and then other shelves are decor stuff and all that so but I'm really happy on how this turns out and it's easy for them just to pull it out grab it grab one of these and I'm utilizing the full shelf by doing it this way so that makes life easy I will go ahead and link those I bought them off Amazon paid for them myself um, so we will go ahead and link those for you guys